Would you be the preacher? Would you be my? What's the dun the dun dun? I still got a lot of shit to learn. I'll admit it. What's the dun the dun dun? Hi guys, it's me Julia, and today I'm gonna be vlogging for you guys. Today is the first day of spring break, and I'm super excited to just chill for the next two weeks. So I'm gonna go to the stable now and see Luna and yeah, we'll see what I'm gonna do with her. And yeah, I just wanted to show you my riding outfit of the day. Today is a Godo kind of day. I am wearing my Godo Alia performance shirt paired with my Godo cruelty free belt in gray and my Godo black breeches. And these are the Aubrey Pro breeches in a black. And then down here, I'm just wearing a normal animal socks. Another thing, I thought I'd film a room tour for you guys. This is my door. And when you come in, first thing you see is my bed. Looks like this, really simple. I got my computer over here. Um, yes, my bed. I got a mirror right here, which I used to get ready. And I also do my makeup just over here. My makeup's here, I don't have much. So yeah, I don't really do too much. Um, I got um, my ribbons hung up over here. My first ever riding helmet tack that I still haven't brought to the stable. Uh, I got some photos. Just come on, zoom. Okay. Me and Luna, me and my sister, me and my dad. <laughs> so yeah, and on this side, we have my desk. This is where I do my homework and study and stuff. It's really simple. Um, yeah, my school supplies and other, ugh, all these IB books, very fun. More photos of me and Luna. This is a show season calendar, but yeah, I'm not showing, so kind of useless. So yeah, that, that, that is it. That is my room. And oh yeah, my prom dress is hanging over here. Prom slash graduation dress. And yeah, that is, that is it. I just got to the stable and the stable is pretty flooded. It was raining so much. It's gonna be nice to ride in the puddles. Luna's in here, as you guys probably know. If you've seen my barn vlog. Let's go inside. Are you? What are we gonna do with you today? Um, let's groom you first, and then I don't know what to film. I haven't planned anything. So here, I decided to do some clicker training with Luna. What we usually do first is called targeting, and this is what I'm doing over here. I always have a little treat bag on the side of my belt my clicker and here I have a target object. I pretty much show it to her and as soon as she touches it with her nose I press the clicker and reward her with treats just so she understands the sound and the meaning of the clicker and yeah that's called targeting and I usually do this for like five minutes before I start um, any like harder or more challenging things with her. So I pretty much just move the object around to different heights and yeah as soon as she touches it with her nose, I reward, I click her, and give her the treats. And I've been doing this with her for a few weeks now, so she already knows what targeting is, and she gets the hang of it really quickly. But as I said, I just usually do this to warm up. And then what we do next is practicing how to smile. So this day was our third or fourth session on teaching her how to smile. So as you can see, she already knows her basics a little bit, but we're still working on making it perfect. So what I do is I raise my finger, which is the cue for smiling, and she will raise her upper lip. I click with the clicker, and she already knows that the sound that the clicker makes means what she's doing is correctly, and then I reward her with some treats. And then I usually repeat this for around five minutes, and as you can see here, she didn't want to continue and I don't force her. Um, I leave her until she comes back to me. And then we keep going. 
And yeah, I think this is so much fun. I love doing this with her. She looks adorable smiling and it just makes me really happy seeing how quickly she's picking up on the trick and how much fun she's having. And my goal is to teach her a few more tricks after she really knows this one. Like I really want to teach her how to hug and how to like lift a leg and like basic things like that. And but just saying uh, this is my first time actually ever teaching her a trick so I am not very professional and if you want to know how to teach your horse a trick I would watch a proper tutorial on YouTube but yeah as you can see Luna's really getting the hang of it and I'm really really happy with her and yeah we're both having a lot of fun <laughs> Oh my god, Luna. We just finished our clicker training. We do it around 5 to 10 minutes every day. Well, and now I think I'm gonna tack her up and ride her a bit because the weather is super nice. It's a little bit chilly, it's cloudy, and it's perfect for a nice long ride. So, I just got all my stuff ready. I always hang up here across from Luna's stall. So it's all there and just easier to tack up. Got my grooming kit here, so now let's get grooming and tacking up. This is our outfit of the day. Luna is wearing her beautiful set from a question stuck home in the color midnight blue. I love a question stuck home. I have so many saddle pads from them. And then yeah, I'm wearing my beautiful Millbrook leathers and Luna's wearing her piece of Sweden brow band in gold. And here we go, ready to ride. So we just finished our ride. It was pretty nice. We rode in the rain. It was raining and it was windy. It was super nice. Luna was really good. We also went on a little hack afterwards. And oh my god, I got bitten by this stupid like insect. And then I was looking down at my hand and it was just like bleeding. And <laughs> now I'm gonna go clean her super dirty bandages. Can we just take a moment? I mean, you can't see it that well over here, but they're quite dirty. And you give her a wash too. All right, Luna, let's go. Let's get you untacked first. So, Luna is almost done getting untacked. Um, now, here comes the most fun part. Unwrapping the polos, right? This is where I put my stuff after I'm done using it. Saddle pad can stay here to dry. I'll put everything back into my tack box as soon as I'm done with Luna. But now let's undo your wraps and let's get you clean and shower you. We're gonna go to the shower now. Let's go Luna. So this is where the shower is and we're gonna go give Luna a wash. Alright, I just finished showering Luna. I just did her legs and because she wasn't really that sweaty and the saddle area. 
So that was it for today. Luna and I are done now. She is inside her stable now, drying up, wearing her and Kriti wear equine hoof socks, which I love to put on her after we're done riding. Here I actually wet them, so they work as instant ice packs, which is just good for her to reduce swelling and help her with her ligament injury. I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, let me know down below in the comments and don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button. See you guys soon. Bye.